Yeah. I have a lot more options if I just lose a little weight. <laughs> oh, okay. So, you're not even on camera. I don't even have that view. So it's just me and then the monitor. Perfect. Right so you want to scratch your bottom or whatever. <laughs> Go for it, okay? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to teach you this. And it's going to take us probably 15 or 20 minutes or so. Okay. So, well, I'm going to ask you a series of questions. And you have to answer my questions out loud. And if you don't, I'm just going to awkwardly stare at you <laughs> until you do. There's <laughs> only three answers that you're allowed to say. Yes, no, or I don't know, or I can't tell. Okay? Mm -hmm. This is just, I'm going to teach you kind of like on a kindergarten level, because that's how I like to learn. So it's going to be really easy. And if at first you say, I don't get it still, hang in there with me. Okay? And by the time we're all done, I think you're going to understand it a little bit better. Mm -hmm. but I'm just going to teach you the basic stuff. Okay. okay, so all you're looking at is the green rhythm. We don't care anything about the O2 sap, the blood pressure, any of that bottom stuff. So when you first start to look, you know what P waves are, QRSs, and Ts, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to ask you a series of questions. Remember your answers. Yes, no, or I don't know. I can't tell. Okay, so when you first look at a rhythm, look at the P waves, the QRSs, and Ts. Here comes my question. Are there P waves? Yes. yes. Are there QRSs? Yes. Are there T waves? Yes. Is there a P wave in front of every QRS? Yes. Is there a T wave after every QRS? Yes. Okay, do you hear the beep? That's each heartbeat. Bob your head in rhythm of the beat. Is it regular? Yes. If you answer yes to all of those questions, then this rhythm is sinus. Now don't say sinus cac, sinus brady, any of that yet. Just say sinus, okay? So did you answer yes to all of those questions? Yes. So this rhythm is sinus. A normal heart rate is? 50 to 100. What did you say? 50 to 100. 60 to 100. Yes. And so unless they change it, 60 oh. to 100. <laughs> Good guess. You were almost there. Okay, 60 to 100. This one is? 80. 80. So that is normal. normal. So this rhythm is normal sinus, sinus rhythm. All right? I'm, every time I'm going to leave and go change it out. Okay. And when know it was 80 because it was saying 80? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Because I'm counting them and I'm like. Oh, yeah, no. Just look at that. Okay. Oh, that's slow. Mine is breaking. Yeah, that's why I'm breaking. Well, maybe not. Yeah, we are. Yeah. Okay. Are there P waves? Yes. Are there QRS waves? Yes. yes. Are there T waves? Yes. yes. Is there a P wave in front of every QRS? Yes. yes. Is there a T wave after every QRS? Yes. yes. Bob your head to the beat. Is it regular? Yes. yes. Did you say yes? No. Yes. Okay. Remember how I said it off the release? All right. So you answered yes to every question. So this rhythm is? Sinus. 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 A normal heart rate is? 60, 60 to 100. So this one is too slow. So our nursing word for too slow of a heartbeat is? Bradycardia. 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 So this rhythm is sinus bradycardia. Say it. Sinus bradycardia. Cool people will just say brady. <laughs> we cool people. people. That patient's Brady. <laughs> oh, dude, Jackie. Are there P waves? Yes. yes. Are there QRS waves? Yes. Are there T waves? Yes. yes. Is there a P before every QRS? Yes. 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 Is there a T after every QRS? Yes. yes. Bob your head. Okay. 
Is it regular? Yes. yes. Could you answer yes to all those questions? Yes. yes. So this rhythm is? Sinus. 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 A normal heart rate is? 6200. This one is too fast. Our nursing word for too fast heart rate tachy -tachy. is tachycardia. So this rhythm is sinus tachycardia. Very good. And so what are the cool people going to call it? Sinus Not even sinus, just tachy. 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 I bet you <laughs> I know, right? It's gonna it's gonna lull me to sleep. Alright, that's not right. That's not normal. <laughs> Is that a are there P waves? Um, yes. 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 Are there QRSs? Yes. yes. Are there T waves? Yes. 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 Are there are you sure? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. There's, yeah. So, remember the answers? Oh. Yes, no, I or no. Mm, sorry. I don't know. Or I can't tell. Yeah. Sorry. I can't tell. Okay. So, uh, yeah. P, as, a, as a review, are there P waves? Yes. Yes. Are there QRSs? Yes. yes. Are there T waves? I don't know. I don't know. Is there a P wave in front of every QRS? Yes. 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 Is there a T wave after every QRS? I don't know. I'm not sure. <laughs> Bob your head. Is it regular? Yes. yes. Did you answer yes to all of the questions? No. no. So can this be sinus? No. 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 So mm -hmm. this one is called atrial flutter. You, you just need to really memorize this because it's the only one that looks this way. So you see the QRSs, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you see the humps afterwards. Mm -hmm. Do you see how the humps are very uniform looking pretty much. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's called a sawtooth pattern. Did you ever help your dad in the garage? He'd yell at you because you weren't doing it right. But anyway, he had a saw, right? So can you picture what a saw looks yeah. like? So, so we got QRS and then Oh, that was awful. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay, we got, they're too round, mm -hmm. but you get the idea, right? Mm -hmm. So do you see how these things are like that? And there's one too many right there. Mm -hmm. They can be two to four, they can, they can be a different amount. There can be a different amount in here. But you see that. Those are a little rounded looking on the monitor. But this is just something you should learn, that when you have your QRS, and then those uniform humps in between, it's atrial flutter. So what I want you guys to do is picture these things that we're going to talk about in your mind. Okay, so you got your heart, right? What's the top part called? No. Almost. It starts with an A. Atrial. Oh, that's A. And then the bottom part? Ventricles. Ventricles. So the P's come from which part of the heart? Atrium. That's right. Atrium. The QRSs come from? Ventricles. The ventricles. Okay, so in your heart, so when your heart is pumping, pump, 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 P, Q, R, S, T, okay, P, Q, R, S, T, okay. In this case, our ventricle, because our rhythm is regular, right? Your ventricle pumping along just mm -hmm. fine. Your atrium, they, it is pumping, but too many times in between. Like, okay? Yeah, that's exactly right. So, in my mind, I remember flutter, it's like, I can see it. I can see fluttering wings, and so that's how I remember it. So it's like a butterfly wing or a bird flying, right? Mm -hmm. So picture your flapping wings, and what does a bird or a butterfly do? Oh, a butterfly, really, flutter, flutter mm -hmm. along, right? So that's how I remember this one. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, so memorize the distinct sawtooth pattern is what rhythm? Atrial flutter. Atrial flutter. Heather say, atrial flutter. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm going to come over and have it. Are there P waves? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure. Here, let me do something. Let me turn off this alarm so it's not very obnoxious. Are there P waves? I'm not um, sure. Are there QRSs? Yes. yes. Are there T waves? I'm sure. I'm not sure. Is there a, Q, a P wave before every QRS? I don't know. I'm not sure. sure. Is there yeah, a T, yeah. T wave after the QRS? I'm sure. I'm not sure. Bob your head to the B. Is it regular? No. no. Would you answer yes to all of those questions? No. Is there any way this is sinus? No. 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 Okay. So this one, any idea what this one is? The B. I'm just guessing. I'm throwing a what? A guess. V-pip. No. V-pip. You're close. Aphid? Yes. Uh, so oh, aphid. Atrial <laughs> fibrillation. Okay. So remember, QRS comes from what part of the heart? The atrial. Yes. The, the bottom, bottom part, yes. right? Okay. Now, it's not it, it's not regular, but it's not bad, right? So your heart, QRS, pump. Okay. So your mm -hmm. ventricle is pumping, but your atrium <clears throat> is not. It's fibrillating. This is atrial fibrillation. So normally, pump, 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 pump. But in atrial fibrillation, you've got more of this pump, pump, pump. pump. Okay, remember in your school cafeteria and you would get jello in a square, right? On your plate. Or maybe at the hospital. Now, so put your jello on your plate and do that. So what's your jello look like right now? Jiggling. 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 Okay. Ventricle doing its thing. Pump, jiggle, pump, jiggle. And that word for the jiggle is fibrillation. So can you picture now what fibrillation looks like? Jello jiggling, mm -hmm. right? So is this rhythm life sustaining? No. Mm -hmm. Very no. authoritatively stated, but incorrect. It is. It <laughs> is life sustaining. People walk around in this all the time and don't even know that they have it. Now we need to get it fixed because what do you imagine signs and symptoms of your patient are going to be? If you're hypoxic, so I don't know if you guys hear on the video, hypoxia. If you're hypoxic, what are you going to feel like? I'm going to feel tired. Like mm -hmm. it. Right. Exactly. Without and me. that's the big, the big sign and symptom. Exhaustion. I don't know what's wrong. My heart doesn't really feel mm -hmm. right. And I'm just exhausted. And the reason is these numbers I am making up in my head. Okay? So take your heart. One cup of blood goes in. Remember, that's not true. I'm just making it up to show you an example. A cup of blood goes in, pump, boop. Half a cup goes out. A cup of blood goes in, pump, fibrillate. Half a cup goes out. So do you, are you getting good optimum circulation? No. Mm -hmm. That's exactly right. So I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. When I feel my pulse, I don't know, it feels weird. When you go to assess your patient and you're like, this pulse is weird. I don't know. Is it fast? Is it slow? Oh, maybe this is atrial fibrillation. You go and you take a blood pressure and you get a high reading. You take it again, you get a low reading. I don't know. I feel like a loser. No, get your stethoscope out and listen then. Because it could be your patient's in atrial fibrillation. Okay, now. What are they prone to? What do we worry about with these guys? Very good. Clots was the answer. And why? Because the blood never completely empties, it just stays. For those like of you watching, these four students are geniuses here. You're exactly right. So if I got blood going in, but not as much going out, blood going in, not as much going out, where's that blood? In the heart. When I have a lump of blood sitting there like and I bleed out on the floor what's going to happen you come back in a half an hour and that puddle of blood is what coagulated mm -hmm. that's right coagulated they said so that forms clots so when you have too much blood just resting in the heart mm -hmm. you're prone to 
blood clots. Very good. Um, remember how easy nursing is? So let's just solve this guy's problem. Our rate is too fast. Okay. Our rate's too fast? Mm -hmm. So what do I want it to be? 6200. 6, I want it to be normal, mm -hmm. which is slower. What am I going to do to get there? Shock it. Not shock him. Good guess. Give him some medicine. Uh -oh. Okay? You don't even have to know oh, that. The down. But we're going to slow him down. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. right. Okay, now another problem that he's got. He's prone to blood clots. What do I want? No, no, no blood clots. What am I going to give him? Heparin. Medicine Heparin. Heparin. Then his blood. Right? Very good. Okay, so as a review, this one is atrial fibrillation. Picturing it in your brain? Yes. Good. I was really not sure that he's not Oh, yes, yeah. But see, she has a way of putting things so that makes it mm -hmm. makes sense. Okay. Here we go. Okay, there's only a couple more we're going to do. Okay. Are there P waves? Yeah. No. Are there QRS waves? No. no. Say yes. 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 That's all that is. Yeah. Right? Okay. Are there T waves? No. no. Is there a P before every QRS? No. no. Is there a T after every QRS? No. no. Bob your head. Is it regular? Yes. Can you answer? Did you answer yes to all those questions? No. So is there any way it's sinus? No. no. So this one is simply, since it's only QRSs, what is this rhythm? What's the first word? Ventricular. Very good. Ventricular, because it's only QRSs. It's only the bottom part, bottom part of the heart. So the, it's ventricular. A normal heart rate is 60 to 100. 60 to 100. This one is too high. Yes. Our nursing word for too high heartbeat is tachycardia. tachycardia. So this rhythm is ventricular tachycardia. Can you picture it? Mm -hmm. Okay. You're, so, what's your ventricle doing? It's just nothing. What's your atria doing? Nothing. Nothing. Because we don't see any atrial activity, do we? Mm -hmm. Okay. Life sustaining? No. Mm -hmm. No. Not for long. That's exactly right. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Are there P waves? I have no idea. Okay. I'm not sure. Are there QRS waves? Yes. No idea. Are there T waves? I don't know. I'm not sure. <laughs> Is there a P before every QRS? I'm sure. I'm sure. Is there? Um, I don't know. Are <laughs> there a T after every QRS? <laughs> I don't know. You know, we're making a video. I can't wait to see what my awkward looking, <laughs> staring face looks like. I'll probably be horrified. Okay. Bob your head to the beat? There is no beat. <gasps> Why is there no beat? It's not a systole, although it does sound like a systole. So, did you answer yes to all the questions? No. Mm -hmm. So is there any way this is sinus? No. 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 So those up and down things that you see are some QRSs. That's what those mm -hmm. are. So if there are QRSs, what is the what, what's the first word going to be? Ventricular. Ventricular. Now, do you remember our jello from the yeah. atrial fibrillation? Does this one look kind of the same? Some gobbledygook in there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This one is ventricular fibrillation. Remember in AFib, the ventricle was working, but the atria was fibrillating. This time, they're both just fibrillating. So if this is ventricular fibrillation. Instead of pump, 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 it's just the bottom, ventri the ventricles and the atria fibrillating. No, they're not doing so anything. So they're not. They're just quivering a little bit. So that's why you get a just you know you got a little bit of action there because it's quivering just a little bit. But 
How come there's no, why aren't you bobbing your head to the beat? Because uh, there's not, there's not, there's not there's no anything. beat. Just That's exactly right. Shaking. You're just shaking. Okay. Is this patient alive or dead? Um, they they could be alive. alive. No. no. They can be totally dead only. Okay, they're oh. dead only. They're they dead. Alive. When you coded your patient this week, mm -hmm. this was the rhythm that your patient was in. Ventri ventricular fibrillation. His eyes are closed. I don't have it going, but if I had the blood pressure right now, what would the blood pressure be? Zero. Zero. What's the respiratory rate? Zero. Zero. If you feel for a pulse right now, mm -hmm. you got nothing. Okay. So this guy is as dead as dead can be. We always think of a systole flat line as mm -hmm. dead, but this is just the same dead. Okay? Mm -hmm. So can you picture your heart? What's it doing? Just mm -hmm. quivering. So if I'm only doing this, is blood going in? No. Nope. Mm -hmm. Is blood going out? No. Nope. Okay. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. Treatment for this? First treatment is, what's the first yes. thing we want to do? Pulse. Check pulse, but then <laughs> when we've decided he is dead, yeah. okay. now what are we going to do? CPR. CPR. Okay, so CPR, that's right, but then shocking, shock, shocking and medications. Okay. okay. I know that checking for pulse things that you request are nothing so. Check scene safety. Call for help. <laughs> Call for help. <laughs> That, I kept getting that wrong on our CPR thing because I kept saying like see if they're alive or not and then call for help but you call for help. <laughs> Sorry. Is there P waves? No. no. QRSs? No. 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 T's? No. no. Is there a P before every QRS? No. no. Is there a T after? No. QRS, no. bob your head? No. No. <laughs> we got nothing to bob. Right? Okay. This rhythm is A systole. A means without, not. We don't have anything. Are they dead? Yes. Yes, they are. Um, or you need to check leads. <laughs> excellent observation. You do. You need to check leads. You know, have you ever had a patient who looks like this and you say, <gasps> and they say, what? What's going on? Okay, that's a good sign. Right? We're happy with that. But asystole, he yes. has no, no heartbeat. Got it. What, do we shock this one? No. Mm -hmm. No, just medications. You'll learn that later. Take ACLS and stuff. All right. Is that a beginning? Is that a way you can understand it now? So remember those questions. You're going to always ask those questions in your mind, but you'll just be better at it. So that's how you do it. You'll never be too big for your britches that you won't ask those questions. It's just that when you get good at it after you practice, you'll just look right away and you'll just know. So it'll go quicker. So in the meantime, ask your nurses at clinical, hey, give me a strip, would you? And practice that and just go through those questions. Can you remember them? That's why I made you go. That's why we had to answer them every single time. If you can't remember, then we'll go and, and I can review if you want to take notes. For those of you on tape, I wouldn't let them take notes while, while we were doing this. All right. Got it? Yeah. Yes. So those are the very basic ones. There's a, there's a bunch more. Right? But no matter what, that's how you do it. Got anything to say to your friends? Very helpful. This was very helpful. Nice brown nose. Thank you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go turn on. I'm trying to increase my color. <laughs> your color? Yeah.